The Melbourne Rebels' final hopes took a hammer blow after a heartbreaking 2017 loss to the Highlanders at Dunedin. The match was heading towards golden spot before New Zealand referee Paul Williams penalised Richard Hardwick for failing to release him on the fault within three minutes of downtime. It was a tough decision to score ball against hardcore winger in second half, as Williams felt former Wallaby had swept him off his feet. He let Highlanders centre Sam Gilbert dodge game-winning penalty in 84th minute to break out of stalemate and seal three-point victory. The penalty for Hardwick, who added salt to the wound, came just minutes after Williams missed a clear penalty inside the kicking range. With just 40 seconds left, Highlanders winger Jonah Nareki gave Joe Pincus a good interception, but continued to drag the Rebels' outside back spare a metre on the ground. This led a coup as the Rebels tried to cross over again the side. You cannot do this. Ty S6 IGKBWC RTGCU 9K9 IJ. Michael Atkinson, May 20th, 2023. Both teams finished Saturday's game with 15 points. Three of them outside of the top eight leading to the finals and desperately looking for a win. Now, Scots have moved up to eight and could go a long way towards sealing a spot in the final if they can beat seventh placed Reds at home next weekend. For the Rebels, they will have to defeat the Force and Brumbers in consecutive weeks to stand a chance. But even then, they will have to rely on other teams to lose. There was tension on Saturday afternoon for everyone to see. Kevin Foote, his assistant Tim Sampson, looked horrified and frustrated over over in the second half coaching box. That was no longer the case with Sampson getting up from his chair and walking away when Hardwick was suspended. Foot's side was brave. Indeed, Scots owned the entire territory, but Rebels' defences endured valiantly. The Highlanders, however, only managed two tries for their entire area, and their decision to reverse shots on goal came back to bite them. They looked like they were about to score a game-winning third attempt when Captain Billy Harmon charged Reese Hodge in the 75th minute and hooked up with James Ledgers just metres from the Rebels' line. Somehow, however, Andrew Kellaway managed to get himself under the substitute and unbelievably thwarted what seemed like a certain trial under the bars. Eventually, the Rebels' resistance came to an end when the Highlanders' most consistent player in 2023, Gilbert, was handed a pressure cooker penalty and kept the season alive. Previously, Highlanders jumped to a seven-point lead when Connor garden Batchup's try was rewarded despite a strong batting cue to the winger before final pass. Rebels winger Lorchi Anderson looked like she would come back from a lineup game in the first stage when she dived into a smart ball from Stacey Illy in the 22nd minute. Anderson fell slightly behind the line and could lie down, but chose not to, recycled, and Hardwick dived in.